So in terms of agenda, uh, as I mentioned, I've got a few workshops listed on here, and I'm really going to, um, I'll say, skip through a number of these slides, so uh, I'm sure you can read them on your own, um, but we'll, we'll try to focus more on, on the workshop piece of it. We'll talk a little bit about the introduction to process and business process management. Um, we'll talk about, to me, what is probably the most powerful tool uh, that, that uh, I've used, which is the SIPOC. How, how many of you have created a SIPOC before? So, so some of you have created SIPOCs before. I think um, I've, I've found that this tool can be so effective in so many different ways. And so I hope I can uh, share that with you and, and walk you through some of those uh, different ways. We'll go into a more detailed process map as well and do a workshop around that, um, looking at different levels of detail that we can go into. And then we'll talk a little bit about improving processes. So we'll talk about ISO certification and Lean and Six Sigma um, as just a few of the methodologies. Of course, there are others uh, available, and we won't go into the theory of all of them, but, um, but we, can, we can talk in, in some generalization. One of the other things that I want to make sure, we may not have time to talk in detail, but is the importance of stakeholders. I think as we, as we look back yesterday, I saw a quotation in one of the videos that said, organizations don't perform, people do one by one. And as we, as we really think about that, it really is about the people. And, and the one thing that I've learned in continuous improvement is that if you can't get the people to change, then everything else you do will end up being a waste of time. I've spent enormous amounts of time analyzing data sets in Minitab and doing statistical analysis. But if the people are not willing to change, if the right stakeholders are not willing to change, then all of it will be fruitless and wasted. So I don't want to underestimate this, right? Stakeholder analysis in continuous improvement is really critical. We'll talk also a bit about um, some lean concepts, uh, Muda and Tim Wood, where we look at re removing waste from, uh, from processes. We'll also talk about the cause and effect diagram and how, how this can interrelate with uh, the process maps and, uh, and also value stream mapping. <coughs> so the first part, we'll, I want to define a process, right? I think you saw a process definition on, this, uh, on the last slide. And I want to go through and, and define a process, and then we're going to set up a small process. And, uh, and I hope I can get a few participants to, to help me out with it. So what is a process? A process is a coordinated and standardized flow of tasks to convert a set of inputs into a specific set of outputs. 